Today we had a patient uh, 56 years old with severe back pain um, with sciatica that means shooting pain into her leg and the problem was disc degeneration between L4 and L5 vertebral body because severe back pain we had to go for a fixation if it's a small disc herniation we can do a small disc removal and the pain in her leg will go but if she has too much back pain this will not improve so therefore she needed decompression that means making space for the nerves removing the old damaged disc and put a cage between the vertebral bodies second and then um, putting screws and fixing them so that there is no movement and also no pain. We um, proceed the, the surgery with the newest technology from Brain Lab. It's navigation, robotic arm and X loop. The navigation helps us to plan the screw before we insert any instrument, any screw into the patient. For this we have to acquire images Therefore, we need the loop X. This is a um, CT scan intraoperatively. The loop X is an intraoperative CT scan. We can acquire images like a real CT scan and we can plan on the CT scan. We send the images directly to the navigation tool and on the screen we can plan our screws. Additional, there is a robotic arm. This robotic arm helps us with the navigation, with the previous acquired images to find our target 100% accurate on spot for each screw for each level. We used this also the first time here in Kuwait and it was um, very helpful. Um, we could find our trajectory, we could insert our K-wires. K-wires are preparation for the screw insertion. Um, and uh, during the surgery we didn't need additional x-ray to check position of the screws um, we used the navigation we used the robotic arm and we could place our screws and after the screw placement we did um, another check with the loop x and uh, the images were clear we could see all the screws were in perfect position and uh, there was no um, problems, no other issues, no complications, no nerve damage, no nerve compression. So this makes our workflow um, easy, uh, confident and with 100% um, accuracy for the safety of the patient.